at deaf clubs you would be able to meet deaf people. <coughs> and truly deaf people all around you and you see them but you just don't know they're deaf because you don't actually walk up to them and talk with them. So you probably, you know, have seen strangers before that are deaf but you just aren't aware that they're deaf because you don't actually speak with them. Or maybe I just think you were rude and ignoring me. But you're right. I don't think I've ever noticed anybody deaf at the grocery store or at the bank. But I, I think that's a good suggestion. If we could have somebody, we could find somebody deaf to come in and um, talk with our staff. I will try to set that up for the next work day. Have somebody come in and talk with the staff and explain. Um, but in the meantime, I think maybe I would like to set up a meeting with you and Mrs. Fowler and myself to talk about the problems and see if we can come up with some solutions. Um, what would be a good time for you? I work until 4 every day. And school is never try to. Probably around four is good. Is me. one day better than another day for you? It really doesn't matter. Yeah, um, doesn't matter which day. If you want to go ahead and call me prior to the meeting, you know, not do it last minute, but let me know before to set something up. You can call the relay service. Are you familiar no, with that? I've never heard of relay. What's that? You've never read it's the ADA? Bill O'Brien? Every month you pay to use the phone service. So you call the relay service, and then the relay service calls B. So it's an interpreter who acts as the go-in-between. TDD. Can you tell me what that is? It's a telecommunication device that deaf people use. And it's like a typewriter. But <coughs> you put the phone on it and are able Do to type Do all deaf in. people have those? Most deaf people do own one. Can you use that to call out of your home? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can contact you if you also have a TTD. If not, then you need to use the relay system. Hmm. I've never seen one of those. Do you think we ought to have one of those in the school office? Yeah, that would be very nice if you guys could get one of the devices. The problem is that most people, most hearing people, don't really want to use them and don't know how to use them, so they're not familiar with them. Would the deaf adult that comes to train the staff know about a TDD? Would he be able to teach us how to use one? Most deaf people are familiar with TVDs and can explain to hearing people how to use them. So yeah, they would be definitely able to do that. So if I were going to call a deaf person, I would need to use Relay? If you don't have a TVD, for TDD, then yes, How would I get that relay. number? Is Relay listed in the telephone book? I can go ahead and give you that number. You can call that How would I get that I'll number? Are they listed in the telephone book? Yeah, they're in the telephone book. Do you know that number? 
Yes. Seven two. Okay. Two nine six. Okay. Tell me that again. I will need to remember that. Okay, I'll do it slow. Please. Which number did you want again? Okay, it's one eight zero seven three five eight two six two. And then two nine two. <laughs> You have been very helpful today, and I am confident that we will be able to resolve this problem with your child, um, and no one will be picking on him anymore. I will talk with Mrs. Fowler and arrange a date, and then we will call you through Relay, North Carolina, and set up an appointment for us to talk, and I will call the Division of Services for Deaf and Hard of Hearing and see if they can recommend a person to come do some in-service training uh, with our staff. It was really nice talking with you today, Mr. Clark. I, I appreciate you coming in and letting us, uh, help making us aware of this problem, and I, I feel confident that we'll be able to resolve it. Also, I just want to caution you, if the problem is not resolved, I'm not going to hesitate to be moved by Well, we, we certainly don't problem. want that to happen. We want to work with you, and we want to make sure that your son is happy here at school.